Hey guys, today we are going to be doing uh, the sick note by the Dubliners. So here we go. Dear sir, I write this note to inform you of my plight, and that the time of writing I am not a pretty sight. My body is all black and blue, my face a deathly gray. I write this note to tell why Patty's not at work today. While working on the fort and for some bricks I had to clear, and to throw them down from off the top seemed quite a good idea. But the gaffer wasn't very pleased, he was an awful sod. He said I had to cart them down the ladder in me hod. But clearing all those bricks by hand, it seemed so very slow. So I hoisted up a barrel and secured the rope below. But in my haste to do the job, I was too blind to see that a barrel full of building bricks is heavier than me. So when I had untied the rope, the barrel fell like lead. And clinging tightly to the rope, I started up instead. I took off like a rocket, and to my dismay I found that halfway up I met the bloody barrel coming down. Well, the barrel broke my shoulder as it knew the ground it sped. And when I reached the top, I banged the pulley with my head. I held on tight, but numb with shock from this almighty blow. And the barrel spilled out half its load, fourteen floors below. Now when these loading bricks fell from the barrel to the floor, I then outweighed the barrel, so I started down once more. I held on tightly to the rope as I fell to the ground. And I landed on those building bricks that were scattered and around. And when I lay there on the deck, I thought I'd pass the worst. But when the barrel reached the top, there was a bottom burst. A shower of bricks came down on me, I knew I had no hope. In all of this confusion, I let go the bloody rope. The barrel being heavier, it started down once more. And landed right on top of me as I lay on the floor. It broke three ribs in my left arm, and I can only say that I hope you'll understand why Patty is not at work today. There you go. See you guys later.